What's happening everybody and welcome back for some more city living. Thanks for sticking around till part two and uh, we are picking off, picking off, picking up right where we left off at Colden's house at the party. Except he's not happy. He is not pleased. Actually, something stinks. Something smells. And it better not be one of our guests because they are getting kicked out real quick. I don't think it is. But I think everyone is getting kicked out, because I think Colton's just over it. He's tired, he needs to pee, he's just, he's hungry, he, he wants everyone gone. And there's only like, what, 30 minutes left? That's fine. It's totally fine. Yeah, we're gonna end early. And, uh, not a bad party. Maybe it looks, a little extra seating would make it go better next time. Are you trying to tell me how to throw a party? Are you- are you trying to tell me how to throw a party? I know how to throw a party. <laughs> Clearly I don't. Because there are so many people with no pants. Uh, check your Sims household inventory. Okay, in a minute. Colton, why don't you go use the bathroom real quick? And actually, Paolo, I want you to catch- Catch Marcus before he leaves. Because we need to quit all of our clubs. We need to- Resign from powerhouse. Oh, we, we can actually resign from party house as well. We're just gonna quit all of them We're we're also over it don't want to be a part of the clubs anymore. No come back Marcus, please. Oh, no Marcus, please go chase him. Go chase him. Go chase him. Where'd you go? Paulo You teleported you disappeared over there and you came back over here. You teleported my dude Why didn't you tell me you had magic powers? Huh? Huh? Why are you looking so smug? Why didn't you tell me you had magic powers? Poli- Ugh. I'm in shock. Oh wait, she's still here. We can- we can, um... Uh, shmeh? <laughs> Trash another sim. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna get her to, um... Oh, gosh. Why can't we just resign from- from... Here? Where- where... What am I- who am I looking for? Marcus. Can we- we can send him a text. Alright, I guess we'll just do it tomorrow. Um... I don't want to deal with this right now. You are not gonna go ahead and do that. We have, um... A bunch of dishes everywhere. We'll also clean that up in the morning. We are not in the mood right now. This is someone's... Someone else's mac and cheese on our keyboard. We're gonna go ahead and get ourselves a job because I have realized that we are pretty damn poor. And if I'm not mistaken, the rent for this place is 500. We don't even have that. So we're gonna go ahead and find a job. Cause that's something we need. And uh, we're gonna get one of the city living jobs. Yay! And Paulo already has a job, which is actually pretty damn handy. And uh, he works at 2 p.m. Wonderful. And uh, Hey, neighbor, can you kindly keep the noise down? I can hear you through the drywall. Please be considerate. Other people live here, too. It's just... We were just having a huge party and not one complaint. We're just gonna ignore her. It's because you're an old and you have sensitive ears. All right? That's literally it. So, there are three new careers. The critic career, in which you can become an art critic or a food critic. There's the politician career, where you can become a politician or a charity organizer. And there is the social media career where you can become an internet personality or become a public relations figure <laughs> i think that's like you can't become public relations you become a public relations figure or something like that whatever we're gonna go for internet personality what's trendy what's the best food in town what's the most interesting celebrity what's the most who's the most interesting celebrity i can't read guys i'm so sorry Start a career in social media to be the person that answers these questions for their followers. Blog and check in at venues to keep followers coming back for more. Wonderful. That's what we're going to do. We're going to invite them to all our parties, and we're going to have a bunch of random people showing up at our house all the time. Uh, get a jump start and accept- Yeah, we get a jump start and accept the assignment. Okay, you can- uh, Oh, Lord. This, sorry about this. This is- it's the MC Commander mod. It um, automatically moves Sims in to uh, open houses. And so it like notifies me. I'm going to turn the notifications off. So, what is our assignment? To create a social media profile. Right here, social 
social networking create a social media profile we're gonna go ahead and do that because uh because we can and uh, we're, we'll turn off the music for dear old grandma who is still standing out here breaking her back are you just gonna be mad at the door forever you're doing so much yeah mm-hmm okay cool um, we made a new social media profile. Nobody can go anywhere in the social media sphere if they don't have an online presence. I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> okay, never again am I gonna speak like that. Um, so we can gain followers and- Oh, I was reading that! Use your social media profile to gain followers, grow your network, and become an online powerhouse. Cool! We can totally do that. Let's... Let's... Not click on the computer. Alright, let's um, check total followers. Delete social media profile right after we made it. Let's actually update our status and be like, Just had an epic rager. Gonna go hit the sack now. Where did Paulo go? Where is he? Oh, he's in the bathroom. I didn't see him. You scared me? I thought he like disappeared. Alright. Um, you can go ahead and go to bed. With a little bit of luck and perfect timing, your social media status update has intrigued the world. Colton has gained 25 followers. Woo! 25. You gotta start somewhere, am I right? Okay. Um, how about you go to bed as well, and we can all reconvene in the morning! Alright, let's speed on through this. Um, I just wanna mention a few things, so I want to... Let's... First of all, I'm gonna turn on... Oh. Oh. There we go. Okay, auto lights, all these lights. And, uh, clearly you are a terrible and inconsiderate neighbor. You just made a big mistake. I will remember this. Go ahead, Granny! Are you sure your- your memory won't fail you and you'll forget tomorrow? You know, I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see. Anyway, I wanted to thank you guys for, uh, thank you for sticking around till part two and, um, I apologize- apologize! I apologize. I'm so sorry for all the mistakes and all the, like, little things that just didn't work out in part one. Like, I know the mouse cursor wasn't there. I it, hope it's there now. I should have fixed that. And I hope I fixed the mic issue where, like, there was a bunch of scratchiness and stuff. So I hope everything is better. And, uh, I am excited to, uh, start part two. And, uh, yeah, and just have everything working more properly. Anyway, we want to get to know Colton, sure, and we want to throw a party! Hey! Of course, we can do we can do one again. We want to also throw a party. We love throwing parties. It's from the from the lot trait! Oh, that's so cool! Uh, first of all, we need more money to redecorate and uh, make this a nicer place, and I think we could totally shrink this room, like, by one square, and just have more living space, and... Yeah, have more epic parties. And actually furnish our balcony. Like, that would be cool. Um, so what are we doing? <laughs> where are you going? Where, where were you going? To the great outdoors! Oh, it's this way. The great outdoors is this way, honey. Um, where... What am I doing here? What was the desired goal, Paolo? I don't know. Alright, we are all we are all hungry. Everyone in this household is hungry. But this house is actually a big mess. So let's go clean everything up. Let's see if we can clean everything up. Because everything is dirty. Everything is dirty. And it all smells. There's dirty dishes in our in our room. Because people were eating in our room. They were sitting on our bed. Oh, and there's just a random drink. Let's just uh, put that there. Hey, Paula, let's go experience more of the unique culture that the city provides. I hear there's an opera tonight around 8. Want to go? Hell yeah! How do we do that? How do we go to an opera? At 8. Oh! I think we have work. I don't know. You know what? Yeah, we're gonna go. I wanna go to an opera. How do we do that? Is there like a special way to... Special place to go or something? How do we go to an opera? I wanna go. Let me go! Hello, mailman. Lloyd! Lloyd! Lloyd what? Lloyd- Floyd? No. Lloyd- I can't. Dubois. I, I keep- I kept thinking it said Boubois, and I was like, that's interesting. Hello, Lloyd. Is that mail? Do we have mail? Is that bills? Is that our rent? That would be so sad. That's not even our mailbox. Look at you getting all excited for no reason. Which one is our mailbox? 
Oh, this first one. Okay. We don't have anything. Wonderful. <laughs> I don't want to get mail or pay rent. Um, so what I think we are going to do is we're going to get Paolo a keyboard because, uh, because I think that's something he'd be interested in. He is musically inclined. Am I right? According to his traits? Yeah, he is a music lover, so I think it would be really cool to get him a keyboard. We also don't really have money for a keyboard. Or space. Let's put it outside, right? Let's put it outside. We'll get him a keyboard. Let's see how much it costs first. Let's see. Keyboard. Nope. Mm. Skeleton keys. Ah, here. Keyboard. Digirad. Insufficient funds. Good times. How much does it cost? 900! That's expensive! That's an expensive keyboard. Okay, yeah, we clearly cannot afford that. Sorry, my bad. Is there something we can do to make money, like, besides go to work? We're gonna have to go scavenging for stuff. Alright, once you're done eating that- I thought you were making food for everyone, but no, you were just selfish and made yourself a garden salad. Lovely. Um, go eat something real quick. And, uh, you can go shower when you're done. And I'm just gonna get them ready for the day. Just a little bit. Ah. <sighs> and, uh, then we're gonna do- Then we're gonna, gonna go out. And, um, we need money is what we need. So we might just go down here. Do any of us have any music skill? Do you have a music skill? Um, you have a DJ skill? Can we busk with a DJ skill? <clears throat> mm, my bad. Mm, I don't think so. Uh, I keep thinking it's the other way. Um, how about a busk with guitar? It's only guitar or violin. Or keyboard. So, no! No, we can't. But, we can go tip this lady and uh, get the golden statue outfit. Yeah? I think we can do that? I think we can do that. Maybe. Hey neighbor, I'm bored. Wanna hang out for a bit? We can just socialize or do whatever your heart desires. You're our neighbor? Since when? This is- Asher! We love Asher! Does he live here? How are you- Sure, come on in! Again with the no pants, but yeah, yeah! Yeah, come here, come in. I should really get going now, thanks for hanging out with me, see you later. That was the quickest hangout of my life. But alright, if that's what you call hanging out, then sure. What are you doing? Practicing dribbling. Okay. Sure. Sure. Um, speaking of, I feel like we could go visit the gym, because Paolo needs to work out, right? For his job? Yeah. Let's go do that. Let's go visit the gym. We're gonna go. We are gonna go. How are you feeling? You just need to shower. That's fine. We can do that there. Let's go. <laughs> We're gonna go. Right? Oh, and we can invite Marcus, and then quit all of our clubs. Perfect. Good plan. Man, that loading screen took forever, and uh, I don't even think Marcus came. Like, he's not here. And we didn't take Colton. What is he doing? Home fitness skill. Um, let socialize with? No, that's not what I wanted. Let's, uh, we can bring him here, or we can have him build a skill. Yeah, let's have him let's have him build the comedy skill and we'll just switch back to him when uh Paolo goes off to work. So, this is Sky Fitness Gym. It's actually beautiful. Like look at how gorgeous that is. Super pretty. And then there's Oh, there are fireplaces up here. Oh, how nice. Whoever furnished, like whoever made the lots for City Living did such a good job. Like this right here, this is really damn cool. I have zero creativity when it comes to making lots, to building, to building in general, like to building, to furnishing, to anything. Oh, there's a downstairs? Oh, I was wondering where all the bathrooms were. But yeah, so this is, this is incredible for me. But I'm thinking maybe we will bring Colton here because Marcus stood us up like the bum that he is. And uh, Colton can continue working on his fitness skill. And, uh, they can actually just... Oh, no sweat run! Yes, let's do that. They can work out together. Let's have them work out like good old pals. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Alright, because... Paul is going to go off to work soon, and he needs to... 
he just, he really wants to, really wants to do basketball. Alright, fine. Uh, what happened? Paula was caught pretending to be a star basketball player. How embarrassing. Who caught you pretending? There's no one here. What, like, did someone from across, like, someone in that apartment right there it was just like, Oh, I see, I see you over there, Paulo. What are you doing pretending you could be something you're not? Anyway. <laughs> um, we are getting a text. What is happening? Congrats on learning that sweet job. Thanks, Eva. I want to get to know her better. I feel like she's super cool. A super cool gal. Alright, let's try that again. Dream big. What does that mean? Show me. What does it mean? Oh, oh my god, look at all those sparkles. Woo! Oh, oh, alright, we need to get screenshots. I love screenshots. Alright. Whoa, look at you, Paolo. Look at you. Talk about dreaming big. Right? That's what this interaction is called? Wow. See, my basketball skills are like zero. So, this is actually quite impressive. Quite impressive. The amount of basketball I play is equivalent to... Um... I don't know. <laughs> okay. That's it. Let's keep watching. Whoa! Oh! Oh no! Oh no, he fell! Oh, he missed! Oh, it didn't work out! Oh, I'm so sorry! Oh! Oh, he's embarrassed again! Caught pretending! One more time. What?! Did you just pull some random mac and cheese out of there? Out of where? What, your, your sock? You had it hidden in, like, your gym shoe? That, put that down. Stop it. Oh my goodness. You're not even hungry! <laughs> oh my god. Oh, there's a protest happening! Oh my god. Let's go join! You know what? Why not? Our friend is here. Well, Colton's friend is here. Colton's friend is in it. We, this guy's here. We know him. We're, who's this? Who, who are these people? We know like some of these people. Can we join? Let's go join the protest. Let's go. Let's go. Let's do it. You, I don't know what to do with you. You just keep embarrassing yourself. You can go shower. <laughs> How about that? That sounds like a good idea. Let's go. Let's join the protest. Oh, I think they're protesting. Money for everyone, right? Or like... I don't know. Oh, look, we got a sign. Oh, look at us. Oh, look at the little pig. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, you tell them. You yell at them. You use that megaphone. Yeah. Stick it to the man. Tell him what's up. Does this actually even ever do anything? Oh my god, she is so pretty. Oh, there are so there are so many things flying in my face right now. Okay, <laughs> just, let's go take an overall picture of this protest. You can't even see him. <laughs> the thing is blocking his face. Um. Oh my god, oh, it's that cool grandma! Oh, is this girl gonna join? Yeah? Yeah? Oh, her name is Emily. Emily, that's so- she's so pretty, oh my goodness. I didn't make her, I don't know where she came from. She's gorgeous. We're gonna- we're gonna say hi to her. Hey, I heard you became friends with Braxton Edge, he's pretty cool. Thanks, sis. We should- we should take her somewhere in the city. That would be really fun, that would be really cool. Oh, let's let's go. Oh, we can't. Can you not be a protester? Wait, no, she's leaving. Okay, wait, come back. Um, cheerful introduction. Is she? Does she have commitment issues? All right, let's go say hi. Let's go say hi. She's super pretty. Aw. All right, I'm gonna lower the volume because I feel like it's kind of loud. Oh, hey. How are you doing? You know, let's uh tell her an un unbelievable story. Did that just change? Am I seeing things? Huh. Can, we can read it. Let's go read it. I've never seen it before. I've never seen it change. Oh, lo and behold. No pants lady. No pants, no pants people. No pants tribe up in here, I'm telling you. 
Oh, and Paula went off to work. Alright, see ya, my, my boy. My dude. <laughs> see ya, pal. Oh! My goodness. Who are you? Oh, wait, hold on. SimSpeed brings you the very best in tire technology, presenting the SS01. This tire has a superb radial design with a hardcore racer in mind. The tire compound was designed to provide a very best balance of performance, longevity, traction, and consistency. If you cannot improve your lap times with the SS01, the tire is probably not the issue. See, this would be useful if I had a car, which I do not, because in The Sims 4 we can't have cars. So, uh, I don't understand why you're telling me these things. Is that the advertisement? Is that what happened when we read the sign? Is this a chair? Are you advertising a chair? Can we read it again? This is fun. <laughs> Landgrab Pictures presents Foldy in the Big City. Foldy was a simple chair, but he had big dreams of becoming a big star. He wanted to have pictures on billboards and become a star like all the other big time chairs. What better place for Foldy to succeed than in the big city? Oh my god, that's hilarious! I love Foldy! Foldy the chair! <laughs> That's great! He kind of He's kind of like us. Me and Foldy. Colton and Foldy are cousins. Yep. That's what it is. We also want to succeed in the big city. Um, we were looking at this dude over here. You've got one snazzy outfit on. Oh my goodness. And look at that. Look at that stare. Yeah, you stare them down. You tell them what's up, man. Ugh, no one can beat this guy. Look at him. Look at Look at how wonderful he is. See, I wish I could go out topless in short shorts and a wrestler's mask and be as cool as this guy. Sadly, I can't. Uh, do these just, like, periodically change? That is so cool! Can it change again? I want to read another one! I love Foldy the chair. What are you doing? You're using the bathroom. Okay. Alright. Oh, there's another one! Let's go read it! Go read it! <laughs> We're going to be known as the reader of all the signs by the end of this, by the end of our life. We're going to be, we're going to have read all the signs. All right. Diamonds are for Sims. Rumor has it that M More Q Corp is smuggling national treasures out of Egypt, including the famous pink diamond of denial. Can James Pond infiltrate their headquarters and return this natural treasure? To its rightful place in Al Simhara. <laughs> James Pond! Oh my god! I love it! I love James Pond! He's my favorite superhero! Woo! <laughs> That's lovely! Oh my god. These signs are hilarious. We need to read more eventually. But we're done we're done for now. We're good for now. Um this is our friend. We should go we should go say hi. I love seeing our friends. Um Seeing our friends around town. Let's go. Let's go say hi to him. And uh, let's go check out the rest of this area, cause there's more. Like there are people walking around up here. Oh, it's a bubble blower. Oh, let's go. Let's go blow bubbles. Come on, sit and try. Can we? Can we do that together? Like, can we change flavor? Xanadu sunset snow flurry. What is it now? Oh, let's try the... D whatever. Let's go. Come on. Don't let me down. Bye! It was great talking to you, but I've got bubbles to try, and people to see, and things to do. <sighs> oh, it's Braxton. Also no pants. I'm, I'm gonna eventually fix the no pants issue. Eventually. I promise. Let's, let's try these bubbles real quick. Can we know what flavor it is? No. Okay. Wonderful. No? No bueno? Not good? Do they just taste bad? Like, what's up? You gotta tell me. No? You're just thinking about it? Thinking about it? Contemplating? What is it? Uh, from confident from protesting. Lifted! From using bubble blowers. Ah, that was relaxing. Okay, can we change the flavor to maybe Jade Dragon? What's that one? Blow bubbles. Do it. Hold on, let me let me get a picture of this. I uh, I love bubble blowers. They're so fun. They're just uh, they're so fun, so fun. All right. 
Oh, oh, that one didn't go down so well. Nope. Yeah. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Introversion. Leave Colton alone. Well, if you say so, okay, let's pick another sim for our let's play. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I guess that one didn't go down so well. Mm, that's sad. That sucks. Alright, what else do we got here? Oh, we got a fireplace. What? This is like a private lounge. Like, this would be a nice, like, proposal spot. This would be so cute. Imagine coming here and getting engaged, and it's super pretty, and it'll be, like, nighttime, and, oh, and you can get some fireworks and, like, launch them into the sky, and it'll be, oh, nope, they set the building on fire. That's fine. <laughs> That's fine, right? That's okay. All right. Let's go ahead and... Oh! Oh, it's that, it's that girl! Let's go say hi. Let's go talk to her. Let's, um, joke about cartoons! Everyone loves cartoons, right? Let's go make a joke. Because cartoons are hilarious, right? <laughs> oh, she is so pretty. So pretty. Let's go. 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 Oh, the romance festival's in town! That's perfect. So perfect. Okay, wait. The romance festival's in town. Click on any of the dynamic signs around town to find out more. Was that the thing that we were clicking on? Is that a dynamic sign? Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Is this a dynamic sign? Yes, it is! Oh, that's so cool. Okay. Um, can we see festival info? Oh, this is so... Oh, I'm so excited. Anyway, um, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this part here, and we are going to go to the romance festival in the next part. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Leave a comment, leave a like, leave a suggestion, leave anything you want. And uh, I will see you all in the next part. Stay tuned till part three. Thanks guys. Love you. Bye bye.